the award-winning Beyond Vaudeville program with your host, Frank Hope, and your co-host, David Green, Barry Williams, Wavy Gravy, Sucrete Gable, and lots and lots more. Okay, welcome once again to the Beyond Vaudeville program. And as you can see, uh, as always, we have a lot of uh, a lot to get uh, done with today. So we better uh, get hopping uh, right away. First of all, I'd just like to thank some of the people uh, on behalf of uh, the whole Beyond Vaudeville show. We'd like to thank people that have been writing in. Uh, Franklin Schaefer, thank you, and uh, uh, Finley and Mr. Mr. Uh, Mr. Brillig, thank you, and. Uh, Boren, what's your fir first name is CC, CC Boren, and uh, Mr. Fable, Fa Fable, okay, Jim Fable, who liked uh, our Turkish lady, uh, must be referring to uh, Karima, the, the belly dancer that we had on, right David? Okay, all right, David, let's not get started right, right away like that. Uh, now, uh, there are a few things we want to show you. Uh, go, uh, the, this I, I found, the real Ghostbusters Slimer Bubblegum, and it comes in a tube just like toothpaste, and it's, it's like green slime from the, from the movie. And it's real, and see, it's just like the Ghostbusters slime there. All right, oh, it's really not very good, though. Um, also, um, the, uh, oh, the Charlie's Angels Pendant uh, with Farrah Fawcett Majors. It's very nice for... Uh, little girls will enjoy that. Be like uh, their mommy with the uh, wearing the thing. Um. Oh, well. <coughs> <coughs> okay. Uh, now. Oh. Uh, also, we have the Mr. T. Mr. T. Uh, coloring and activity book with pages and pages. Three three hundred and oh, three three hundred and eighty four pages of activity with Mr. T and all his kids. See, there he is teaching you how to do crossword puzzles and all kinds of things. Yeah, I bet you like 384 pages of activity with Mr. T. Okay, David. Well, maybe it is very good for a, a rainy day, right? Uh, all right, David, this is yeah, something... Yeah, just what kind of activity? Okay, David, this is something you would enjoy because this is, this is a little mean, but it's also fun, too. These are called hand blasters, and you, you put them together, and they snap like that, like, like caps. And this is so good. You know, when uh, years uh, years ago, when I uh, was younger, and I had caps, and rolls of caps, and you had to find a big rock that would uh, smush it against the concrete to make the noise. But you had to keep rolling it out. Now you just have the two balls, and you just uh, snap them together. Okay. Well, uh, as I said, we have lots and lots to take care of today. And uh, I think if you were looking closely at the credits, uh, you might have recognized that first name. Because, uh, as you know, uh, we're all fans of, uh, here of, of uh, the popular Brady Bunch series. And uh, I think you'll be very surprised to see what's, uh, what's become of one of, uh, at least one of the Bradys. Uh, he's become a very uh, accomplished uh, actor in the theater. Uh, uh, I have a book here from uh, Kids on TV, and it has all kinds of shows. It has the Bugaloos and uh, the Double Deckers, remember them, H.R. Puffin stuff. And, and, of course, uh, the best show, one of the best. I was just talking with my friend uh, Bill Coleman that this show, oh, this show is, we were having an argument of what, what, what was better, the Brady Bunch or the Partridge Family, and I said the Brady Bunch was much better. And here's uh, some of the stars, and uh, you'll see them all there. And, oh, oh, we have to hold it for a surprise, okay. And uh, so there are two of the sons. You know the third one. You all know, okay. And, uh, and there they are. With a, this is, this is a, well, when he was very young there. This was a young picture. And I got them all. Now, also, I have a copy of Teen World, which uh, has uh, has our, our special guest right on the cover there. And I'll tell you, uh, well, let's bring him out so we can share this all. Okay, let's please welcome Mr. Barry Williams, please, to the show. How do you do, Mr. Williams? Hello, good to see you. Uh, this is this is like uh, this is your life here uh, on Beyond Vaudeville. I'm sorry, I I didn't want to yeah. uh, I didn't want to. Uh, oh, that's a co-host, Dave Green. Uh, okay. Uh, in I, good mood today. Yeah, better than usual, I good, think. Good. Uh, good. He's. Um, well, I don't want to dwell well on that. Have fun. I'm so, okay. Now I, I don't want to dwell on the on the Brady Bunch because I know it's you know because you are doing very big things now and I want to I want to go maybe we could go backwards. Let's start like what what you're doing now. 
Okay, and uh, now you're doing uh, all kinds of shows. Look at all, and you're getting all these great reviews for Promises, Promises, and A Funny Girl, and uh, I Do, I Do, and uh, Romance, Romance. Now, oh, how come all these shows have two names, Prom like Promises, Promises, I it's, Do, I Do? It's in case you missed the first part, you want to make sure that you know the, the, the title of the show by repeating it. Okay, but you'll it do... It makes it stick in your head, I Do, I Do. Okay. Promises, promises. Well, that makes, that romance, makes a lot of sense. Uh, maybe we should call this Beyond Vaudeville, Beyond Vaudeville. Beyond Vaudeville, sometime. Beyond Vaudeville. Okay. It works. It really works. Uh, now, uh, um, so, but you won't limit yourself just to shows that have double titles like that. The, like, Well, it depends on how much I'm paid. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, now, um, I, I was going to bring out one of the, these magazines and uh, these are uh, um, so my favorite magazines. Some people I've think I've changed, collection. you know, over 20 years, but I don't think so, really, do you? No, no, I think, it, uh, except for the mustache, I don't think well, uh, Dad would have liked that. Uh, they wouldn't let me grow one then. Okay, now, we, we I have, couldn't uh, grow one then either. They, they mention here that uh, it's, it's too hard to zoom in, I guess, but uh, they... Well, it's just your magazine's a little faded there. Oh, well, it's, it's getting, it's getting it's older little, uh, here. I guess uh, down on the bottom, see, see, there's Barry. And uh, uh, he was at work. Now, uh, they said when you, uh, well, I wrote down here, you got, uh, where, you got the most fan, fan mail on the show. 1971, you got 6,500 fan letters a week. A week? And, and my hand got kind of twisted from trying to answer them all. Did you write back? I learned to type. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, and, um, well, we, we have lots, lots of magazines here. But uh, yeah. now, also, uh, we, um, I, uh, oh, oh, hello. Oh, okay, oh, uh, Barry. Um, in the uh, in one of the last seasons, you had uh, Robbie Wrist, and we found out he's look what he's doing. Yeah, we found him. He's doing a, a band. Uh, You're the first person I met who cares. Is oh dear. Well, I thought he was good. No. Well, and, and, uh, okay. well let's just say that as soon as he got on the show, it was canceled. Oh. Uh, I, I remember the lad. It wasn't the last show with uh, Ken Berry, and they, they had the three kids. They they brought in yeah, new they kids. Were, they were going to make like another Brady Bunch out of the Brady Bunch. <laughs> right. <laughs> and and then, meanwhile, the, but except the, they were going to use all ethnic kids. Oh, but the Brady Bunch kept going on though. You did a, a special. Uh, you did a, a show with uh, Mar Sid and Marty Croft. Yeah, uh, we did the. Uh, it was a Brady Bunch variety special. And and that in that one, the the dad, uh, your dad, uh, changed. He wasn't an architect. He became a, a TV guy or something. Did was, he? Was that in? Uh, oh, what show? Was it? The, uh, the Brady Bunch Hour. The Brady, Brady Bunch, Bunch Hour. Variety Hour. And then the cartoon. We had the Brady Bunch cartoon show. And then we had comic books. Mm -hmm. We did the Brady Brides. Mm -hmm. It's been a fairly substantial part of my career. And and there's <laughs> <laughs> and there's a lot more to come. And it's good that and, and you see and he has fun with it too and that's good. We we like that. Uh, Barry, and uh, you have uh, to, or, or life would really be, you know, a drag. Okay, but you know, but this you is gotta, you but gotta, you, you got to roll with the punches. And you keep going now, but now you're doing all this theater. What, what's up ahead? What are you? What are you? Well, you know, uh, like immediately, like tonight. Well, you mean? Oh no! Like, uh, are you thinking more, uh, doing more shows, more theater? Uh, well, I mean, tonight I got two shows to do. Oh, two okay. shows. I'm doing a little. I came, you know, I live here uh, in New York, like in the neighborhood, and I've been doing musicals, plays, musical plays here. Okay. And I'm doing uh, uh, this this show called uh, Slay It with Music, which actually is something that you might enjoy. It's, oh. It's it's okay. about um, uh, horror pictures and slasher films, and I play four different roles. I okay. get killed three times. Oh. Hatchets in my head, swords, and it's funny. Oh. When it happens, now I don't know why it's funny when it happens, but I die a lot. Wow! I die a lot, and that's uh, so you get all kinds of uh, you get your audiences, are all types freaks. of people, freaks. freaks. Oh yeah. boy, freaks, weird people. It's downtown, you know, so which helps. Mm -hmm. And just about anybody walking down the street comes on up, and and they seem to like it pretty well. Okay, uh, now, uh, Mr. Williams, we we want to uh, uh, keep you with us, but we we do have more people, and we want to get everyone out. So we're finished uh, already. No, no, no. You didn't not, show my album. No. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Thank you uh, for reminding That's me. That's from it's 1972. Meet the Brady it's, Bunch. It's, it's recent. And this has uh, for all the fans of the show. Uh, it's at the beach. It's at the beach. At the beach. I still have that shirt. I wear it sometimes. Oh, mm -hmm. that's a nice shirt. She's beach. much right. bigger than this now. Who, which one? This, this, this one here. The little one. That one, yeah. She's okay. bigger everywhere. 
and uh, they do they do American Pie and Time to Change. Remember when the kid when the voice changed to your younger brother? Uh, not when I your real brother, but well, did right, the, the younger on the, the one show. in the middle of the yeah, he yeah, got right. his he voice changed. It didn't, wasn't really changing either, but just he, he act oh, acting. Oh, see what see what you find out by watching uh, Beyond Vorpal. Uh, that wasn't his voice wasn't really close. I always thought maybe his voice was really changing. And then and they then, wrote the script around right, really changing. Right. right. So there's a little piece of uh, news. Oh uh, wait, I have a trivia. Oh, it's, oh, uh, what was oh. What was your mother's maiden name? Uh, I, well, write your answers in, and uh, we should give away a prize for the right answer. We don't want to oh. give we don't want to give everything away right here on the air. Okay. Okay. All right. Now uh, let's please welcome our, our next guest, Mr. Williams. I, please the clue stay. Is it wasn't bunch? No. Oh, it, it wasn't was not, bunch. It was, it not, was not bunch. bunch. It's a clue. That's just a clue. Okay. So. We'll write in your answers. Really and uh, please now let's welcome uh, Mr. Uh, Wavy Gravy, please. So. Okay, please come, uh, come join us, uh, Wavy. Uh, we, all right. Okay. Wow. Look at all that color. That's. If you want to talk? You can just lean over into my shirt. Okay. Here, here you go, Mr. Gravy. Uh, you want to get intimate, huh, Mr. Gravy? Oh. Mr. I, Gravy, call me, call me Wavy, Wavy Gravy. But if you call me Mr. Gravy, that means you want to get intimate. Oh, wait. I ha How about... Ooh, some peanut brittle. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, ah! <laughs> that was a good one. Huh? That was fun. I call, call you anything but late for dinner, right? Don't call me right. late for dinner. For years, people said I had no middle. Then I grew one. Oh. Uh, now, uh, Mr. This Gravy... This is very I spiritual don't... for me to be here because... Uh, uh, leave no turn on stone. Uh oh. Okay. <laughs> Look at all this stuff. I'm uh, with the. Uh, whoops! I lost my uh, device here. Uh, okay. Uh, just let me put that back on you. You need a lapel, uh, uh, Mr. Gravy. Uh, okay. Now, uh, now people aren't going to recognize you with that nose and hat, but uh, anyone that's been following all this Woodstock stuff that's been going on knows that he was the uh, MC there, and that must have been that must have been something. That was a while ago. Uh, uh, I tell people that these are the good old days, the '80s are the 60s, 20 years later, old feathers, new bird. And recently, I am evolved into the divine dodo oh. of the First Church of Fun. And uh, uh, I would like to uh, 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 perform a ritual uh, uh, for the First Church of Fun and, and kind of, if you, if you be, would you like to become a funny? Uh, we've never had a ritual. That's what this. happens. Okay. That's, even Let's... for poor people. Okay. And uh, in order to do that, the uh, first thing I need is my device, which is in here. This is my uh, one-stringed instrument called oh. uh, Ektar. Ek 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 Ektar. 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 It's a one-stringer, uh, and it's uh, it's a mess. Oh. Uh, I tell people, many strings, never in tune. One string. Sometimes I get lucky. And here now, uh, uh, you take this oh, one. Okay. Just hold on to that. And uh, and and here, Mr. Uh, that's uh, David. Uh, David, David, David. I'll just open it up. Here, you get one too. I okay. get one too. Just, just, I'll tell you what to do with it. it, we'll it just place it, it here for right now. In a bit. Oops, oops, oops. This is, this is. Dark. That's a little better. This song is for my friend John Brent and my guru, Harpo Marx. We are climbing. Harpo's Ladder. Sing it with me. Same verse. It repeats. We are, come on. Climbing Harpo's Ladder. Just an opera hat full of yellow chickens. Hit it, puppets. Just, Just an, an opera hat full of yellow chickens. chickens. He was a soldier of the clowns. He, he was, was a soldier, soldier of, of the clowns. Clown. Sing it at home, too. Now, now. Uh, now. Soldier, do you... Love my cream pies. Everybody reach out at this time and grab an invisible cream pie and, and hold it in your hand. Decide, it weighs about two or three pounds. Either hand. De decide if it's chocolate. Okay. Yeah, that hand's good. Uh, uh, coconut, uh, lemon meringue. Sir, you want to grab your pie now? Pumpkin. Okay. Well, Pumpkin. Uh, he's, he's, he's grabbing a pie in his head. <laughs> you folks out there in the audience could also grab a pie now, please. Hello. Uh, Sucretti, come on, get your pie. Decide <laughs> if it, and, and take that, you can commit pie aside. Or you can squish it in your friend's face and lick each other off wait, uh, and sink right wait. now. Yeah! Oh, oh. Soldier, do you love my cream pies? Sacred implements. Sacred implements, Sacred implements of the clowns. Harpo's Ladder, we are climbing. Here we go. We are climbing Harpo's Ladder. 
we are climbing Harpo's Ladder. Just an opera hat full of yellow chickens. He was a soldier of the clowns. Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Now that noise there, that's the funny mantra. I'd like everybody to do the funny mantra one time. Use your whole face. Too. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Like this, try. Let me hear you out there in the audience too. Let's all, and all you puppets, come on. Now, now, my guru, now stop for a second. My guru, my guru Harpo Mark says, if all else fails, if you're on a bummer. You ever get in a bummer, a bummer in New York? Right? Yeah, stand on your head. Try that. You stand on your head and no matter how big your bummer, gravity will get you smiling. Or if you're on a bummer, you could get some snakes, you could get a cuckoo clock. It's hard to stay serious with a bird hooting at you every 15 minutes, except uh, I had a water pistol. I used to squirt it at until finally it rusted in place. Well, Wavy Gravy says, if all else fails and you're on a terrible bummer, what you do is you take, you take a paper bag. Paper bag? And Right, like you gave us. Uh, yeah, like this. Right. This is with handles. This is a good one. It just fits over your head. And uh, you might want to help him with his bag. Yeah, oh, I, I don't think you want to do that, Barry. Don't. Maybe not. No, no don't, maybe don't not. Do Free choice. No, really? Free choice. Well, do you want to... You wanna, uh, no, wait. He doesn't okay. like to play with this. Play okay. Games. Well, if you take a paper bag, you guys wait, and I'll show you here now. Okay. You take a paper bag that just fits over your head, and, and you get your... You get the, your mouth right up against the paper really gently, and you do the funny mantra. <laughs> you, turn in, you turn into a living kazoo. So let's all put our bags on now. Well, okay. And when I say three, we'll all do the funny mantra and turn into a living kazoo, okay? Uh, okay. And you folks at home, you can go get your bags also and put them over your heads when I say three. Here we go. Bags over the heads now. Here we go. And one, two, two. three. Okay. Go for it. <laughs> Let it vibrate. One, two, three, again. And last time, one, two, three. And whip off your bags and sing with me. Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Harmony now. Kind of, kind of raise up in your chair when you make that noise. Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Soldier, do you love my whoopee? Sacred cushion. Sacred cushion. Sacred cushion. Of the clouds. Harpo's ladder. Last time, kids, with gusto. We are climbing. Oh, Come on. We are climbing Harpo's ladder. We are climbing Harpo's ladder. Just an opera hat full of yellow chickens. He was a soldier of the clouds. Ow! Oh, yeah, was... give yourself give yourself a round of applause. That was very there. nice. Uh, a round maybe. of applause. Thank you, uh, thank you. Now, uh, I'm, I'm sorry that we didn't have our next guest in. Uh, will she be able to be, have fun if she didn't uh, do this uh, along from, from, on the, from over here? Our next, oh, no. No, those are the, the dolls, the toys. Oh, no, I thought they were... Candy. No, that's the gum, the slime gum. Oh. Uh, okay. Uh, I thought it was... Well, uh, if we can just introduce our, our next guest, so we, we have our, our, every, everyone here, uh, please uh, welcome uh, a very uh, uh, popular New York uh, uh, celebrity, and, and her name is uh, Miss Sukrit Gable, please. Yay! Oh, thank you. Uh, lady. Hello, Sukrit. Uh, there you go. Sorry, Sukrit, I just got to grab a few things here. Uh, okay, just move that over there. And everything is uh, under well, control now. Well, thank you, now. Mr. Wavy Gravy. You're welcome. Okay. Toward Ooh. the fun, toward the fun. <laughs> Uh, now, Sukrit, uh, you are, uh, well, well, I guess first we should say that uh, every year we do an annual uh, stage show for the homeless uh, benefit, and uh, last year Sukrit uh, hosted, and that's what the poster was. Uh, we, we had a lot of people uh, you got show it up. Wrong. Uh, oh, no, what? Uh, no, that was the poster for the ear, nose, and throat convention. Oh, boy. I, I mean, you know, that, that was a demonstration of how wide an average American female could open her mouth and keep it that way. Oh. That was the wrong poster. Oh, okay. Well, well that was. Uh, that was probably very late at night, right, at, at one of the clubs, because you go around all the time to the, all the, uh, the places. When yeah. I'm invited. Oh. That was to celebrate Michael Musto's birthday party, and it was my singing debut. He sang, You Made Me Love You. You know, it was the story of, of, of um, Clark Gable and Judy Garland. He said, you sang like a canary on the witness stand, dear Ms. Gable. 
and I fell in love with you. Now, you mentioned the witness stand, uh, Sukrit, and that's how a lot of people got to know you, because you were all over the papers in New York, and, and uh, I'm sure there's no one out there watching who doesn't uh, remember all that when, when you were involved in the trial. Blind justice! But, but that's all behind you now, right? That's all, no. Oh, please, yes. I have a much, much, much nicer career singing like a canary, this time in nightclubs. And, and you're going to be at the, 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 the Trocadero. That's, That's right. The name I have it, a right? show coming Trocadero. up in Greenwich Village at the Trocadero. Okay. A special Halloween show. All oh. about witchy woman and come on to my house. I'm going to give you candy. And werewolves of London. David, oh. do you think you could, yeah, I was hoping David could give us a, a little werewolf sampling here. David, do you want to do that, David? Or, or maybe? Or maybe Wavy Gravy could help you by telling you how to do it. Number there we go. one. Uh, well, we're going to have stuff like that, a special Halloween show on the 29th and the 31st. So okay. come on in my house. Okay, now, so you're singing and uh, you tell some jokes too during your show? or do you I'm irrepressible, what can I say? Oh, okay. I mean, the jokes sort of pop out. I don't necessarily plan them, but, but sometimes people ask strange questions or make me do odd things. Now, uh, oh. And, and so there we go. <laughs> Okay, now uh, all all the other guys. Uh, now, uh, Barry, you're in the you're living in New York now, right? Oh yeah, and, the only place uh, to you live. are. So are you single? I, uh, yeah, I'm single. Oh, not for long. Not for oh, long. we could have a, a match well, made on I the board. Well, at least I asked, Mama. Yeah. I asked. Right, okay, yeah. feel better now? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's important. It's always important to ask, especially in the city. Uh, well, I won't ask Dave because he won't give me an answer. But but Mr. Wavy Gravy, what about you? Are you single? No, I've been married for twenty four years. Oh. To the same woman, and then before that, I was married to another woman. For 24 years, too? No, only for three years. Well, that doesn't count almost. Oh, okay. Well. Oh, well, I tried, Mama, I tried. Uh, okay. Barry, have you been married at all? Or did, uh, you're oh, not? No, I've, uh, not so, yet. So not maybe, yet. Uh, maybe so, well, we'll see what soon, happens. Soon, soon. Uh, okay. Uh, Wavy, you're not living in uh, New York, though, right? You, you live out on a, a Winter Rainbow, Camp Winter Rainbow? No, Camp Winter Rainbow is the circus and performing arts camp that I've been running for 15 years in upstate California. I'm with an expanded family called the Hog Farm, and uh, we've been together, we'll be together 25 years come, uh, come Labor Day. We have a 500-acre ranch in Laytonville, California, where we have a three-acre lake named Veronica, the raft's name is George. The kids learn juggling, tightrope, trapeze, uh, clowning, improvisation. We have Native Americans that do ritual sweats. I call it survival in the 21st century or how to duck with a sense of humor. That's what we teach the kids, timing, balance, and where the edge is, which is very predictable on a tightrope. Now, uh, uh, Barry and uh, Sucrete, were you, uh, were you two around at the, the Woodstock when they all got together uh, or, or, or no? I remember what you got. I did too. I waited for the movie to come out. The movie, okay. Yeah. I yeah. swear to tell the and truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. I was planning to go that weekend, and had I known that Wavy Gravy was going to be there, I would have made it. I got to I got to stand up in front of everybody and say, "Good morning. What we have in mind is breakfast in bed for four hundred thousand, <laughs> which is when we introduced we actually uh, introduced granola to hippies. They never saw it before." In Dixie Cups, who we went around to their sleeping bags, here's your breakfast in bed. Well, it looks like gravel. It looks like gravel. I says, just eat it. You're not what you eat. You are what you don't Try think. it. You'll like it. Oh. Yep. And, or you could eat the, the little, uh, my little puppets that you were eating, uh, uh, Wavy. Marshall Efron has a new cereal for New York, uh, honey. Like, not an asshole. Oh, boy. Not an asshole. It's good. Hi. Mm. Hi. <laughs> okay. Somebody, somebody, a New Yorker said they were watching, they went to turn on the World Series. I overheard this guy. He says, I turned on the World Series. All there was was nature, nature, <laughs> nature. Oh, but, okay. Uh, now. Uh, hi, uh, hi, Mr. Chicken. Okay. Are you Everything's single? under control. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh, what did the chicken oh. say when it laid the square egg? Ouch. It said, ouch, that hurt my butt. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. Oh, Mr. Chicken. See, now you have a joke to take home uh, to, to, to well, tell your family, I guess. The egg right. must break uh, itself in order to aspire to omelethood. Okay. Uh, Dave, do you have a question for anybody, uh, uh, our distinguished uh, panel? Uh, you, uh, yeah, you must have some thoughts. You've been sitting there uh, quietly. We've been playing. Okay. He, well, that's because he didn't t do the uh, the fun thing before. Yeah, the, he's been having fun in his own so. way. It's, in his it's, head. A, it's a little one-sided, but he, I think he's been. He having likes fun. the bubbles. Yeah. He makes he makes good good nostril noises. And uh, maybe maybe it's good to have some balance uh, mm -hmm. like that, right? It takes two wings to fly. Okay. 
that's right. Just like Sal, uh, <laughs> Sal, Sally Field of uh, uh, the uh, Okay, so uh, oh, Secret, uh, what are you? Uh, what else is going on? Uh, what, what, uh, what else are you up to? Uh, coming up. Well, uh, I'm planning a whole series of new shows, and I have a couple of TV appearances scheduled, and uh, things are cooking. I'm also writing an article, which I hope will tell my story of what's happened in the last year. And mark my words, it's very different than what you see in the papers. Okay. Uh, uh, Wavy, I don't know if you want to do that. No. See, Barry's, Barry has the right idea. I'm getting nervous because I know that he, I'm going to get hit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> maybe you guys are one way to <laughs> sitting next to him. Why, maybe, maybe you want to sit change? next to David? Remember sure. what they used yeah. to say on the hour gang comedies? Think... The bigger they come, the harder we fall. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay. Well, we only have two minutes, but you know, any, anything could happen anything in two minutes. Happen. So maybe, maybe you want to switch. switch. Okay. Why don't we close? We're going to close out with uh, one of the Brady Bunch uh, songs, oh, uh, Barry. And uh, good. do you have any preference, uh, Barry? Oh, I think they're all equally, equally excellent. Equally excellent. Yeah, something that we could all sing along with or lip sync to would be fun. Okay. I'd like to try a bag. Well, here's a here's a big hit uh, that you've probably you've probably never heard done by uh, the Brady Bunch, but here it is. Uh, okay. Get the just just let it sit. Just let it. Okay. Oh, don't do it. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. It, it must have been the. Uh, he doesn't like the little handles on the bag. Oh. Okay. Alright, we're gonna close out with uh, American Pie by the Brady Bunch. Yeah, I do. I thought I, I thought that we sort of added a new meaning to and significance to this song. It's not easy to to do a slide, a vocal slide like that all together. Nitrous all six, all, all six, six. Like he likes the nitrous oxide. Well, I think a wavy gravy pie would be appropriate for this version of American Pie. Yes. Yes. Yeah, Ameri what what don't you think? Pie aside. Yeah, here we go. Whoa. What kind of pie would you? What kind of pie would you? Oh, something creamy. Ready? Creamy, you ready? Creamy. Yeah. I warn you. All in here. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Ha ha! That was fun. <laughs> Well, they've got a lot of pies in their face. Yeah, Dave, do you want me to help through your nostrils for you so you can breathe? It is a real toe tapper, though. It has a nice, nice rhythm. It's an American pie. He really would like some nitrous oxide. He's, he's indicated this to me. I don't think that's legal. Yeah, you can sing along to this. This is good. Yeah. How's it go? We Snap had a Christmas fingers? album, too, you know. That, that really puts you in the mood, yes. Oh, look, 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 the puppets are singing. And thank you all for joining us, our very special guest. Uh, Secret, Barry Williams, Wavy Gravy, and uh, Dave, thanks for, uh, Dave, for joining Dave, us thanks. again. Really, thanks. The buildings are shaking. David's yeah, there. David's gone to that place. Makes me feel right at all. It's great.